Hello everyone, this is Amit Dan of AmitDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of Chromebook Tips and Tricks video and I'll talk about why you should travel with your Chromebook. I'm going to be playing some of my travel scenes in the background so you don't get bored. And if you're interested uh, watching uh, these uh, scenes, uh, they're part of my New Zealand travel uh, video playlist which you'll find in my play playlist section of my YouTube channel and the first video is going to be actually uh, some scenes from my Melbourne to Auckland business class trip on Qantas Airlines. So I'll talk about why you should travel you with your Chromebook. Uh, the first point I'd like to mention that uh, think of uh, traveling with the Windows computer and a Chromebook. So I have a, a high-end Windows computer which costs about $2,000 and I have a high-end or very good quality Chromebook which costs about uh, $400. So definitely uh, due to the low cost you're going to be much more comfortable traveling with a Chromebook because if you lose your computer you are better off losing uh, a $400 Chromebook than a $2,000 laptop. So that's the main point uh, or that's one of the you know uh, main uh, factors you need to consider when you're traveling with Chromebook uh, because of its low cost and another factor is that uh, it's lightweight it's not like you know heavy like Windows so you can have actually uh, you know very uh, lightweight Chromebook for uh, between like you know three four hundred dollars and then uh, in terms of security no other uh, you know computer or laptops will give you security or peace of mind like Chromebook this is due to the fact that uh, Chromebooks are always encrypted however you know Windows computers or Windows laptops aren't encrypted yes you can have uh, Windows encrypted laptop uh, which is going to be uh, Windows 10 Pro but you need to spend hundred dollars or possibly more for that and then you have to go through the hassle of uh, to or enable uh, BitLocker so it's not you know as simple as Chromebook which by default is encrypted uh, what encryption does is that you know if let's say if you uh, lose your Windows laptop uh, anyone can get a hold of the laptop they don't need to they don't need a password so they can uh, boot the laptop with uh, another operating system and they can you know access your storage and all the information on the laptop and or they, can, they have the option to uh, remove the hard drive from the Windows laptop and they can just like you know put it onto another computer and they'll be able to access like you know the information on the uh, laptop but with Chromebook uh, this is not possible uh, as long as you have a strong password uh, even if you lose your Chromebook you know no one will be able to access your information because you know it's encrypted and the files and folders and everything most of them are you know staying on cloud so even if you lose it there's nothing to worry about so just make sure that you have a very strong password for your Google account and then you're safe to travel with your Chromebook and another feature Chromebook has is the guest mode so what it does that you know you can access to internet without logging into actual Chromebook so you don't have to use your you know email ID or password or anything so you can just use a guest mode whenever you are at an internet cafe or at a shady Wi-Fi uh, that you don't want to like you know enter your password or anything so you can just you know use the guest mode uh, which comes with every Chromebook and you can just like you know do the surfing and everything so that's another layer of security uh, which Chromebook uh, can offer and uh, the cloud uh, you know storage for Chromebook uh, make sure that you know there's no actual data on your device because you know everything is online so you don't really need to worry about like you know stuff or uh, anything on the hard drive so even someone is getting access to the Chromebook you know they cannot they don't have much to do because uh, number one is encrypted and then it's you know most of the stuff they're staying on cloud also Chromebook offers you offline access uh, you know you can set up your Chromebook to uh, give you access offline and you can actually write email and uh, you can use like you know offline apps uh, to play or like you know there are like you know weather apps or travel apps or there's so many apps you can use on Chromebook when it's offline so you don't need to worry about like you know getting online uh, with your Chromebook when you're traveling so that's uh, another uh, you know good thing about when you uh, 
travel with your Chromebook. Another advantage of Chromebook you have is that, you know, uh, let's say you are concerned about uh, the stuff you have on your uh, laptop. For Windows, you cannot just like you know, erase them or get rid of them right away uh, because, you know, everything is there. But with a Chromebook, let's say you're going through customs and immigration and there's some sensitive information you don't want anyone to see. So you can just do it like, you know, uh, power wash your Chromebook and it's going to erase everything. And you can then hand over your lap, uh, your Chromebook to the security or like, you know, customs or immigration or border uh, patrol, whoever, you know, at the immigration, if they want to take a look at your Chromebook. And so they have nothing to look there because, you know, everything is like, you know, blank. But with Windows, it's not like that, you know, it's, uh, you cannot just like, you know, uh, reboot right away and log back in right away, it's not, it just doesn't simply work that way. So that's another advantage of Chromebook, uh, if you're concerned about security or immigration police or customs and security officers, you know, looking up your stuff or going through your stuff, uh, whenever you're, before going through the, you know, customs and immigration, you can just like, you know, do a power wash or you know, hard reset on your Chromebook and it just takes a few uh, minutes and you can just log back in with your password and login ID and then you're back to normal. But uh, definitely uh, this is something you cannot even think of uh, doing with the Windows laptop. So for these reasons I just mentioned, it's always a good idea to travel with your Chromebook instead of your Windows laptop uh, because Chromebook is convenient, it's uh, you know, lightweight, it's more secure, it's encrypted, it's uh, inexpensive. So all these factors lead to uh, make you a better choice when you uh, travel. Uh, definitely, you know, you shouldn't be, uh, you shouldn't hesitate to use a Chromebook instead of a Windows laptop. So Chromebook is the ultimate travel device you can possibly think of. Uh, I cannot think of any other, like you know, operating system or any other laptop which would give you. Uh, so much security and convenience than Chromebook. So for that reason, whenever I travel and I need to carry a laptop, uh, I definitely would take my, you know, Chromebook instead of my Windows laptop. So that's all I wanted to talk about today. Thank you for watching this video. Forget about subscribing this channel. Forget about liking this video. There will be more videos coming up, so I'll see you shortly. Thank you.